Joe, last time I was here, this place did not look like this. No. Um, We've you, got some shapes coming out of the ground. Yeah, yeah, there's a lot. I feel like a lot's happened, to be honest. Um, I think it was maybe, I don't know, a month, maybe two months ago I was last here. Yeah, yeah, just after Christmas, early New Year. So, yeah. And you were digging what, to be honest, just looked like a trench really down there. So um, if you didn't sort of see your visuals, it maybe would have been hard to visualise sort of what's happening. But now we've got walls down there, the structure of the pool is in. Um, what's, what's been happening and what's going to be next? So it's quite extensive groundworks on this job. Um, it seems slightly never ending, but we have a lot of block work to do. Um, so before Christmas and just after Christmas, when you last came, we were doing a lot of concrete pouring for footings. Um, now we've cracked on with the block work, which is why the shapes are starting to sort of appear and things are making a bit more sense. Um, but yeah, I, by the end of this month, hopefully we'll have the majority of the groundworks prepped, done. The swimming pool guys have cracked on, so uh, we'll start backfilling around the swimming pool um, and then hopefully start paving this area behind us in the coming weeks. Um, and yeah, start getting some final finished surfaces down rather than looking at mud. Yeah, yeah, it's the pretty stuff. I love it when it gets to that stage and the job really starts like coming alive. And um, yeah, so we've got a uh, delivery of some of the paving coming in to you probably later this week um, to start shaping up this area. So you've got the Egyptian limestone, the Limington beige going in as steps and like a path around Absolutely, the house there. Absolutely, yeah. So these ground set of steps, there's one set here and a smaller pedestrian set over here, just to link with the path down to more seating further down. Um, but yeah, we're using the 20 mil slab that you supply and then we're gonna ball nose the edge ourselves and uh, cloud all the risers as well. And then planting in between to soften the whole lot so it looks like it's embedded within the bank. Yeah, so those two banks are gonna just come alive with plants. Absolutely, just, yeah. yeah. Beautiful, that's nice. Yeah. And then, um, yeah, so we've got some of the drone footage of focused on this circular area that you've prepped the ground for um what material is going to be the surface material there and that's a seating area on your visual yeah so it's a small seating area that we've used the egyptian limestone pavers so exactly the same material but in a smaller format that we're going to do a radial circle around the edge um, and all the paths around here are edged with those and the paths themselves are going to be gravel um, but that circle will be laid to the six by nine um, units as well, cut within it ah, okay, um, nice. to provide nice. a nice hard standing for furniture. And then again, that entire area and that circle is encompassed with planting um, lots of perennials, grasses. Um, we're going to have quite a few roses here um, as it's quite a traditional property. Yeah, so that Englishy sort of vibe with the roses and stuff like that. Yeah, in. yeah, but we're a little way off that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'll think about that a bit later.